Hey, it's great to be here tonight at Politics in Paradise, where people get to uh, to come out and talk to their local politicians and uh, and ask us questions point blank, and it's just a good time of uh, of mingling and, and you know seeing what's on people's mind. Really finding out, so it's great to be here. Cactus, look! <laughs> no, it's not much different in Sacramento um, when you've got a ruling party that refuses to look at services that the state provides and make the cuts that are necessary and eliminate boards and commissions and departments that are no longer effective or providing the services that they originally intended to provide. The state government funds four things. It funds schools, it funds universities, it funds health and human services, matching federal dollars, and for every dollar you cut from those programs, you lose two dollars to the health care district, to the doctors, to whoever it is that's serving um, health and human services. This is why you have over 9% unemployment in San Diego, or in, in this country, and why it's over 10% in this nation. Because we're taking your money that you work hard for, and we're going to invest it however the ruling party in Congress thinks that they want to invest it, whether it's Republicans or Democrats. The reality is the money is yours. It's your money. If you want to send your kid to a better school, it's your money. Keep it. Send them. I don't want to send but, my kid to Afghanistan. But will there be a, uh, but so will there be a but school that's okay. The you, you think you that we should go, go to war because you're, you're for it. The spending spree's over, guys. I'm sorry. I, you can talk about how much you it's want to spend in Afghanistan and Iraq. It's not a spree. 